Now to Kenya State, where government has laid off at least 3,234 staff, including a 13-year-old girl recruited by the administration of former Governor Omar Ganduje towards the end of his tenure. Secretary to the state government, Bafa Bichi, made this known while briefing journalists on the report of the 22-member committee set up by the government to ascertain the processes followed in recruiting the persons. He stated that the verification committee reported that the employment did consider the actual manpower needs of the respective MDAs, but was influenced by the desire to tie down the new administration financially, among other revelations made during the investigation. A number of those employed were found to have suspicious or forged certificates while many non-indigents were employed in spite of a large number of qualified unemployed indigents, indigents roaming our streets. The employment did not take consideration of the actual manpower need of the respective ministries, department and agencies, but was influenced by the desire to tie down the new administration financially. That those employed were wrongly placed through deployments to non-career posts or, or the calling of their respective qualifications. That there were gross underemployment where officers with higher qualifications attracting senior cadre were employed on the junior cadre of the service contrary to the needs of the MBAs and the approval granted for such employment. That a number of students in their active study years were also found to be employed, including students of junior secondary schools, senior secondary school, and some in their early stages of tertiary education. A number of persons recruited were found to be undergoing their national youth service school. And that a number of persons confirmed to be over age and under age were found to be employed and on the state payroll, including a 13-year-old Girl that was employed into the service. The SSG said a total of 9,332 staff that were found eligible by the committee and were therefore reinstated and their salaries will be restored in a matter of time. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.